Hello, this is Greg from SharePoint Maven. And in today's video, I would like to show you how you can quickly filter lists and libraries by me filter value. Uh, let me explain to you what I'm talking about. So here I have a list of projects. This is a custom list, uh, not a library, a custom list. And among all the columns, I also have this project manager column. And this column has been created using the uh, you know, person type column. All right. So essentially, this is where you can input the, um, you know, the the names of the users from your user directory. Uh, just to show you what I did to create this column, I create I clicked the add column and chose person, uh, you know, person type. And essentially, again, this column allows you to pull users from your uh, Active Directory. Uh, in any case, I felt I completed the list, uh, but now I only want to see the projects that are applicable to me where I'm the project manager. So um, what you can do for that is click this filter icon. And of course, it will give you a list of different choices uh, that appear under this particular column. And one of them that automatically exists now in both lists and libraries is this me value. All right. So if I click this checkbox, I can easily see, in this case, the projects, the rows that apply to me only. Uh, this is the same as if I were to choose my name here, all right? Uh, but, you know, it's just also nice and quick just to choose this uh, me value that appears right on top. So a quick way for you to filter the list. Uh, by the way, the same applies to document libraries. So here, here I have a document library. Again, I have a person column over here uh, with a bunch of names. And again, I can click the filter icon and you will see this me choice as well. And now I get to see the documents uh, where, uh, you know, that appear against my name where I was the author, right? So this is a nice quick addition uh, that popped up recently in SharePoint. Um, and again, you know, just a nice and quick way for you to filter uh, both lists and libraries and take advantage of metadata. Um, that's all for today. Hopefully you learned something new. As always, happy to see you on my blog, SharePointMaven.com, as well as my YouTube channel. Thank you very much. Have a great rest of the day. Goodbye.